my way, my heart. Good afternoon guys, you are watching us from East Africa, Kenya, yeah, so it's afternoon in our country, we are fine over here, I hope you are fine too, and today guys we want to show you how to make a doormat, yeah guys, you can see this is a sack, yeah it's a sack, we have our needle here, okay these are, how can I call it? It's not a, re a real needle. This one comes from the fence. How do we call it? The Kayaba. Yeah. We just pluck it from there. And guys, we are going to use this needle to make our doormat. Village doormat. So guys, you can see we had already started here. Yeah? You can come closer so that they can see clearly. You can see we had already started inserting some pieces of... These pieces of clothes which uh, eh, which we have worn until we cannot wear anymore, maybe they are torn. So guys, we decided to gather those pieces and uh, make a village doormat. Yeah, you can see guys, we have inserted this way. So guys, we are going to show you how we insert them. The needle inside the this sack. Yeah. Yeah, so guys, I'll show you where we removed our needle. This is what I call the Kayaba. <laughs> yeah, guys, you can see this is it. You can see this is a needle over here. So we just pluck this thing and it will act as a needle. Then we use it to pierce through the sack. Yeah, guys, you can see it's our improvised needle. So guys, you are going to use this needle to pierce through the sack so that we can make our doormat. Yeah, guys, you can see. Hey, guys, and around you can see the, there are some popos. These are an avocado tree, a healthy one. Yeah, it's a nice place to stay. A banana plantation over here. Yeah, guys. There are too many banana plantations. There's a mango tree over here. There are some scales. Scales. The skuma wiki. Yeah, guys, you can see they are healthy. <laughs> yeah, so this is it. Just come near. Yeah. So, guys. You can see this is how we make it. You just cut the a small piece of thread this way. Yeah, you'll see how she insert the. Yeah, guys, you can see this way. Yeah, that way. Then she will tie it. Yeah, guys, you can see that way. This is it, guys. You can see, huh? This is how we make a doormat. Yeah, so you can imagine the whole picture of how it will be when we have made it, the whole of it. Yeah, it will be a good one, an improvised one. Yeah, then she ties it that way. Yeah, you can see guys, it's not a difficult thing to do. So instead of throwing the clovers, which you don't wear, yeah, you can use, you can use the the pullovers to make a doormat out of it yeah not a new pullover but that one which you don't wear the one which you have worn until it has uh, wear out yeah that one is the one which you use to make a doormat so guys anytime you are free at home you can improvise a doormat yeah, it's not a difficult thing to do. Not difficult. Very easy. 
So guys, remember to subscribe to my channel, Baby underscore Karo. You are watching me from East Africa, Kenya. Yeah, we are Kenyans. We love you guys. Yeah, guys, we love you very much. Well. So we will meet next time. I will show you the end results of the doormat. Yeah, because I won't finish today. So I'll show you the end results. Thank you for your support, guys. So guys, you can see this is how it will look like. So the all of it, I think it will be, it will be a very beautiful doormat. So guys, we'll show you the end result after we finish to make it on the next video. So let's do it. Bye. Bye.